out Dodder's Riley Busby should probably get used to making headlines. One of the first set of all-female quintuplets in the United States, Riley may look like four of her sisters, but she truly stands out on her own. Mom Danielle Busby had quite a day on April 5, 2015, when she gave birth to the quints via C-section. Weighing just over two pounds each, the babies were closely monitored in the neonatal intensive care unit for about three months. Cameras were standing by when Danielle gave birth to her five daughters, and Riley Page was the fourth to be born. At the time, Adam said of his daughter's small size, I can take this ring right here and, uh, and slip this over my baby's hand like a, like a little bracelet. According to the family's blog, it's a buzz world, Riley was born weighing two pounds, four ounces, and she measured just over 14 inches long. Considering the danger associated with such a risky birth, the quints were, quote, out and off to the stabilization area within four minutes. Even though the quints all share similar features, with Ava Lane and Olivia Marie being actual identical twins, each has their own personality. In fact, when Riley and her sisters were only one month old, Danielle took to the family blog to reflect on how much the quints had changed and how they were growing into their features. I think the biggest thing that's changed is just seeing their personalities like they're quintuplets, but they're all very different. She wrote, Riley reminds me of me the most. She has fair skin like I did as a baby, and she is the only one who has skin like this. As fans of the show know, Danielle has dark brown hair, and as the quints have grown, their features have really only lightened, as they all have blonde hair, except for redhead Hazel. Even though Riley doesn't have her mom's dark features, she still has almost porcelain skin, which is definitely something she got from her mom. Anyone who's watched Out Doddard knows that Miss Riley Page is somewhat of a firecracker. Adam and Danielle explained how they were adjusting to dealing with the quince when they got into their terrible twos. When you've got five of them that are twos and their just brains are all chaotic and everything's theirs, it's a cat party in here all the time. On the episode, they revealed Riley was definitely a handful. It's Riley's personality to be terrible. Even on Riley's biography on TLC.com, she's described as being more than just a little cheeky and theatrical. The site notes, she is a little drama queen and knows how to manipulate everyone around her to get what she wants. Riley sure packs a lot of personality. That much is clear. While both Adam and Danielle occasionally have a hard time dealing with all of it, it's just part of what makes Riley Page who she is. On season five of Out Doddard, Adam and Danielle were faced with a pretty tough decision as Riley tested above her age group at school. What number is it? Two. One. One. Yes, you're right, you're Riley. Right. She ended up skipping pre-K and essentially ditching her sisters and going straight to kindergarten because she did so well on her placement test. In another episode, Adam and Danielle revealed they were a little uneasy with Riley's intelligence. Danielle joked, I don't know if I can handle a smart kid. <laughs> I'm starting to wonder if she's bored and if that's why she always acts up. Of course, Adam and Danielle weren't too surprised at Riley placing above her sisters on the placement test. On the season four premiere of the show, the Busbys confirmed that Riley was indeed the smart one when Adam called her, My little smarty pants. Riley certainly has the smarts to match her sass, and it looks like we're all just trying to keep up. I mean, Riley is way too smart for her own good. After she tested up a grade, fans had some strong opinions about how the Busbys handled the situation, to say the least. Danielle told People Magazine that she and Adam had thought through their decision carefully. She said, Riley's above and beyond with her intelligence. Knowing where she's at right now, this was our decision based on her. Of course, we looked at the family and how this change affects everyone else. Riley may be a grade above her sisters, but no matter how big their achievements may be, all the girls are equally adored in the Busby house. Even though Riley might have taken after her mother's looks, the youngster quickly grew to favor her dad in plenty of ways. She's definitely a daddy's girl, and she loves to grab any and all of Adam's attention. Mommy, where's daddy? He said he would be back before breakfast. In a blog post celebrating the Quint's first birthday, Danielle wrote about how Riley is obsessed with Adam, saying, She is probably the daddy's girl out of the bunch. She will pitch a fit if Adam comes home and doesn't tell Riley hi before the other babies. It is insanity. But that's not all Danielle had to say about Riley's connection with Adam. In a blog post celebrating the Quint's second birthday, 
Danielle explained how exhausting life was with Riley at the time, writing, Oh, Riley, you are your daddy's daughter for sure. Thank goodness we only got one of you in the Quint bunch. Riley may be a smart cookie, but according to her mom, she's all about being the star. In the same post about the Quint's second birthday, Danielle wrote of her spirited daughter, She is the social butterfly in the bunch, and she requires attention. Table. Since when do you shush me? And on an episode of the show when Danielle and Adam were talking about how the Quints had transitioned into their terrible twos, Danielle explained that Riley was probably the toughest out of all the Quints, saying, She's so smart, she's so cute, and she does it for attention mostly. Clearly, Riley has a handle on being the little diva of the bunch, and all those smarts are being put to use, just maybe not in a way that's a piece of cake for Adam and Danielle. It's no secret that Riley is a bit of a troublemaker, and she isn't the easiest quint by any means. On an episode of Out Daughtered, Adam and Danielle explained how each quint's personalities had started to shine through, and when they described Riley, there was a pause. Riley. She loves just to antagonize. I mean, she would take toys away, she picks on the other girls. Another episode of the show featured a prime example of Riley causing some trouble. When Danielle was attempting to clean up after the quints, Riley spilled her milk on the floor. For the crime, she got a timeout. Danielle said, Riley is notorious for spilling her milk on purpose. She does it all the time. Riley is definitely a troublemaker, but for fans of the show, it's all just part of her charm. With all her bold behavior, intelligence, and never-ending desire for attention, Miss Riley Page clearly tests her parents' patience now and again. I feel like some days like, her sole focus is just to push people's buttons. <laughs> She's taught her parents a whole new meaning for the word tolerance, and Danielle, for one, won't forget it. Specifically, in a 2018 Mother's Day blog post, Danielle explained how Riley was constantly pushing boundaries, but that she, of course, loves her daughter no matter what. However hard the day was and how much I fight with Riley, that the night times are always the sweetest. Danielle wrote, Riley, you amaze me daily. I don't know how I have a little girl like you, but you truly are amazing. You have taught me what the true meaning of having patience is, and you constantly make me think outside the box. Previously, for the Quint's second birthday, Danielle had described Riley as testing her patience in a different way, writing, quote, She has no fear and is a daredevil. Riley for sure knows how to push her parents to the limit, but that's just Riley being Riley. Believe it or not, Riley Busby is actually pretty responsible, though not always for her benefit. According to Danielle, Riley is honest to a fault, and she will usually end up being the first to tell on her sisters. In a blog post, Danielle explained that even at age two, Riley was already ratting out her siblings, claiming, she loves to tattletale, even when it's her fault and she instantly blames it on someone else. If someone does something wrong, she is the first to tell us. And that didn't change when Riley turned three. Danielle wrote at the time, We always knew one of the quints would be the tell-all tattleteller. Well, this is Riley. She may not always be telling the truth, but she will for sure tell you when someone else is doing something wrong. Riley may be a quintuplet, but she's actually pretty easy to tell apart from her sisters on the show. Although she shares many of the same physical features as her siblings, Riley's distinct traits really come down to two things, her head and her eyes. In a video on the family's YouTube channel, Danielle explained how she can tell each of the quints apart. When she got to Riley, she said, She has a tiny head and her eyes are really big. Show daddy your eyes, bye bye. <laughs> pretty eyes, where's your pretty eyes? Besides her physical features, Riley also had a personality that stands out from her sisters. Danielle blogged, It's Riley's world, and if you don't think so, you better go somewhere else. She hears the words, No, no, so much that if you say that to another baby, she instantly gives her Chewbacca growl. Right. There you go. Fortunately for the Busbies, there are moments when Riley Page proves that she's not only mostly well behaved, but she's also honest. Sure, she might get in trouble, pick on her sisters, and make messes, but Riley tells the truth, even if that means she's the one who gets in trouble. Welcome to the 
show. <laughs> On an episode of Out Doddard, Riley was caught having made a mess in her closet. At first, Adam asked her sister Parker about who did it, and she basically blamed everyone but herself for the incident. But when Adam went to Riley to ask who made the mess, she admitted it was her and Parker taking responsibility. Riley, who tore up your closet? A Parker. And who else? Even though he was frustrated at the situation, Adam appreciated Riley's honesty, and he even thanked her for telling the truth. Riley may be a bit of a mini-drama queen, but there's no denying the fact that she is still very honest, no matter who gets in trouble in the process. Time out. Time out. While all the Quints have attitude and spunk, they are reality TV stars after all, Riley has maybe the biggest personality. Riley Page. The whole house revolves around Riley. Just watch one episode of Out Doddard and you'll get it. Even though Adam and Danielle love that Riley is unique and has such notable traits, it can drive them a little crazy sometimes. In a blog post, Danielle revealed how the Quints are different from each other, and with Riley, it's all about her charisma and temperament. Danielle wrote, She is a handful to say the least. She is the leader of the pack. But not so much in a good way. She's bossy, sassy, and knows it all. Riley is anything but mild-mannered, and that's what makes her so lovable. Riley's the little instigator. <laughs> Old turd bird. While Riley has definitely grown into her personality these days, she's pretty much always been the sassy Riley the Busbys have come to love. In fact, even when she was a baby, she was the rowdy one. When the Quints were only five weeks old, Danielle confessed that little baby Riley was acting up already. She blogged, does she know how to get what she wants? This girl wants to lay on her belly, like always. And she will do what she has to to get her way. My precious stubborn one. On early episodes of Out Doddard, there was also no denying the fact that Riley Page was a firecracker. She might be the breakout star of this pint-sized bunch, but with her personality and intelligence, she is clearly going places. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more list videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.